Hey everyone, today I'd like to go over yet another useful tool in Google Sheets, and this one is called Alternating Colors. Alternating Colors is a way to make data more easily viewable, more easy to distinguish numbers like the account numbers we have here. It's kind of hard to see what goes to what when they're all tight like this with white backgrounds. Alternating Colors allows you to alternate the color of each row or column to make something easier to see and more distinguishable. There are really two main ways that someone could use alternating colors or rather set up alternating colors. There's an easy simple way where you highlight the range you want to have alternating colors and then you format in here alternating colors and then there's another way in which you use a custom formula. We're going to show both but I'll start by showing the first way where you highlight your whole range that you want to use and you can highlight the header too if you have one or footer if you have one as well. I'll talk about that. Then you click format, alternating colors, and then this window to the right should come up. And the default that it's going to give you is a gray set where color one is the odd number cell so like the first and third row will be color one in this case white and then the even rows will be color two in this case gray and then your header which it uses as a default will be a darker shade of gray now you can use other default styles there's a blue set a green set a yellow set and so on and then you could also choose to omit the header or add a footer. You'll see down here this cell's a little darker. If you have a footer, say you have a row that has the total of whatever you have in your data set, that might be a case where you would use a footer. You could also use both the header and the footer, but for the case of this set, we're going to use just the header and that makes the most sense. Also, what you could do is create a custom style where you could hit this little plus here. You see I had one before like this, saved from before. Then you could also add, a second one will pop up. You choose your header color, we'll do, let's say purple, and then your alternating colors. It doesn't have to be white and gray. It could be white and blue. It doesn't even have to be white and blue. It could be pink and blue which, I mean, that doesn't look good. You're going to want to use white and something else. I like to use white and gray, but you could use whatever you think looks best for your spreadsheet. So like I said before, there is a second method for alternating colors that is a little bit more complex. Not even complex, just different a different way to set up than this method of alternating colors. But I mean, this one's so easy. Just highlight your range format, alternating colors, and then in here it's pretty self-explanatory. So I think this will be a good tool to use to, especially in large sets of data, kind of distinguish what you're looking at and make it more easy to view. Now if you enjoyed this video and learned something, please give it a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.